California, Sacramento area. Lorenzo Powell, he didn't quite get to the finals, but he fought Harley Medeiros. And I thought that for a, for a number 14 seed, he fought an amazing tournament. And to me, it looked like a growth moment where he's he had to lose to a guy with too much experience to get to the next level. You know, and sometimes that happens. That's a part of the sport. That's a part of every sport. So that's that's just one of those things where, you know, you have to wait your turn, so to speak. But I tell you what, though, and, and you, you you bring up a great point. In, in the moment when that decision was announced, you know, there were there were there were a lot of people in that arena, <laughs> you know, who I'm not going to say they disagreed with. I'm not going to go that far. I'm not going to speak for what anyone else was thinking, you know. But let's just say that that fight was was really close and it was a good fight. And, and, and I think Lorenzo has a lot to be proud of in that moment. And Harley's a tough customer, no doubt about it. He's been there before. He expected to win. He did get the victory. You know, he moves on and he's on the national team. But I tell you what, Lorenzo did a great job. And, and there's no shame in him coming up short. And then there were some people that I think would agree that maybe he did. Kind of remind me of Paul Pierce versus LeBron James. Paul Pierce used to get score on LeBron James and it it took LeBron a few more years before he said, you know, I'm LeBron James. Right. And and, that, and that's what that is. Sometimes it just, just takes that, you know, you have those gatekeepers, you know, that uh, that don't want to that don't want to pass the torch just yet. And and the time is coming. And, and again, it would be fun to keep an eye on that and see if we can track that into into the professional ranks and see what that's how that shapes up. You know, when we're doing it, you know, for for eight, 10 rounds and find out, you know, what the difference is there. I agree. What's your, um, I got to ask, how did you get into boxing? What's your relationship with boxing? Because you know, I was always, uh, I, I, for a long time,